Hello, I'm Skid, and welcome to episode 37 of my Monster Hunter Rise playthrough. Good. We are going to be finishing HR5 today. That's the plan, at least. We have one quest to do, and then we have an urgent quest to take on and do as well. Keep an eye on me from up there. But before we do that, we have some busy work to catch up on. We have done all the side quests, we have collected all the materials we need for the weapons bar the Royal Ludroff, which is the um, monster we're going to be tackling first. We found our divine rhinos. Hey you, hey, you call those beetles for me. Yep. My pal over the guild told me about them and I just had to see one for myself. Gotta say, whoa, seeing them, up, um, seeing them for real is just amazing. Huh. And now I want to see one out in the wild in its natural habitats. That would be incredible. Anyway, I left Master uh, Hammond and uh, Nagiko with the weapon blueprints so that you can make some cool gear. I'm sure you'll find it useful. Cool gear that cannot be used. Hang in there. We still haven't been given any kind of special insect life. Now, what are you on about? Welcome to my. If I'm correct, you've pieced together enough notes to form a complete message. Yes. Well, if you don't mind. Mm -hmm. This doesn't actually tell us anything, does it? <laughs> Gaz to think something can pass. Yes, yes. Enlightening read. Thanks. I shall present you with an especially exclusive article. Yeah. Just cosmetic okay. stuff for the house. Um, is there I've a button to bargains. sell from the item box? See what you have. That button is gone. At least I cannot see it. Um, sort order sort. Yes. There used to be a button to sell all just items that you can only sell for money. Okay. We do have plenty of this stuff if we need to um If you're not sure you should sell something, you should probably hold off for now. The fact that you're unsure must mean there's still value to your possessions. No, I know what I want to sell. I'm just deciding whether or not I want to sell it now because this is going to give me way too much money. I'll gladly take it off your hands. Thank you. There we go. I earned achievement because of how much money we now have in our cash box. Okay, Smithy, we have weapons oh, craft. It's you. Forging or upgrading? I be forging. I be forging weapons that have been waiting to be forged. So raffian stuff we've right, got. Let's get cracking. Now we see whether or not I did my math correctly. Um, should be enough. So one of these, four of these. Gotcha. One of these, four of these. Right, let's get cracking. It didn't actually take me as long as I was expecting it to, to um, get that material or get those materials. Okay, so this one we don't know what we need to craft. Even this one, which means the only one left is this one, which is Royal Ludroff, which we may get the first time we kill it. We may not. If we don't, I'll farm it between um, taking on that monster and then taking on um, the urgent quest. Now get hunting. So let's go kill that royal loot Or more accurately, let's go capture that royal loot Uh You can wait a second. I've been waiting for you. Oh, we managed to clear them all out. Um, that, uh, let's get that one, that one, that one. No, yes, and yes. Those two are good. Here's the quest list. Foul play in the forest. Royal Ludroff. Good luck out there. I think predominantly lightning, but I think it's also weak to poison. Something makes me think it's weak to poison. Oh no, predominantly fire, I'm way off. And it's actually resistant to most everything other than fire. Okay, fire weapon it is. Do we actually have a good fire weapon? We may not. In which case, maybe we go blast. Ah, no, we have a fire weapon now. Um, let's see if we can craft the decorations for the fire weapon. 
I don't think we have a... I think Wyberg Ice Attack is the only one we have that has Ice Attack. Oh no, there we go, Wyberg Fire Attack. get this first. More likely, let's see if we can get this first. I got everything you need. Decorations create... Blaze. Oh, that's no problem at all. Stream. Stream we can do without issue as well. Oh, it's actually short on carpuses, but that's fine. That's a tier one material. Um, we have Frost, we could use Bolt. And we don't need these for anything else. There we go. Thanks. Uh, while we're here, let's Hello set there. them. Good luck out there. Uh, no, not yet. Okay, let's get something to eat. <laughs> and then get this started. Okay, so, just while we make our way over there, there's something I need to discuss. So, the, oh, it's taken me six episodes to get through HR 5. We have HR 6 and 7 still to come. Um, and we need to get all of that cleared before the 30th of June. This leaves me with, that's the wrong one. I was trying to summon Taunt. Uh, this leaves me with... Um, nine episodes in order to get through both of those tiers um, to be ready to start recording uh, the week after um, Sunrise comes out. Sunbake, rather. So, I haven't decided yet. It will depend upon how many quests there are in the next tier. I press E again. It's F. Making progress! Uh, so yeah, it'll depend upon the number of quests in tier 6, but we're either gonna... Yeah. We're either gonna start, um... Yeah. I'll finish that sentence in a second. Yeah. So we're either gonna start, um... Um, doing an episode on Saturday and Sunday. Hoping for the other attack. But I put myself in the middle of a combo. Here it comes! So yeah, we'll either start doing an episode on Saturday and Sunday, um, or I'll start skipping some of the hunts. I'm more inclined to do the latter rather than or the former rather than the latter. Its crown is the thing we need the most, so we need to be attacking its head. Crown? Nope, not the. Be careful. That was his sponge. Here it comes. Okay, that's weird. There's supposed to be invulnerability frames in that attack. Long wire. No, I can't do it because it is attacking multiple times. 
We have the wrong, wrong wire bug in the... Not the wire bug. We have the wrong kinsec. Uh, simply by the fact that... Um, we should have brought a severing one rather than a blunt one. Oh, no, you don't! Wrong button. So many wasted potions, not like potions are hard to get. Go! Oh, you went through the tunnel. Um, you're going to the other side. Uh, sharpening is something that we should or should have done. That wasn't what I was trying to do. Again, okay, I'm pressing the wrong buttons and still in um, Elden Ring mode, it seems. again. There we go. Now we can focus on its tail. I was above that. Guy's a little small for the loyal Ludroff in the grand scheme of things. on the small side. It is too many little sneaky paths that can go down. Weapons getting dull. Where's it going? Okay, it's just going to one of the lower ponds.
I know you have a beam of some description. Actually, no, you don't. You're mud. There you go. You have it. Do have an attack. Can we not target that one? There we go. Punish that one. Can you get out of the way, Googly Laku? There's the tail. That's a good start. There we go. We managed to save ourselves from losing. Um... That works for me. That was an easy one that I could have dodged. I imagine the Royal Ludolf is more or less capturable at this point. Do that then. Then let's go. Give, 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 give me everything. There's a tech around here somewhere. I'll put this to good use. Don't worry. I also want to kind of give it the opportunity to lead because it may try to do. And there's a claw, but we're going to need two, two crowns. Smallest sized update. Easy peasy. I, yeah, I thought it looked a little on the small side. Got ourselves a tiny Royal Ludroth. I wonder if it's a crown worthy small one. <laughs> All in a day's work. <laughs> Okay, now we find out whether or not I need to farm this guy a few more times. Uh, we do. We've only got one crest. Fair enough. We won't do that while recording. What we will do is talk to this guy now. Working hard. Hello, again, Skid. An urgent quest awaits you. Um, you've been requested and dispatched uh, uh, to dispatch an agitated uh, Matsusuni uh, in the Shrine Ruins. Indeed. Usually docile, uh, we rarely pay these creatures any mind. However, this particular Matsu uh, Matsusuni um, has gone hopping mad. <laughs> I just don't get it. Get it. Indeed. Uh, the guild will investigate this matter further. Your job is to ensure the monster is dealt with swiftly. Now hop to it. To it. Okay, uh, now let's not talk to her now. We'll talk to her after I've restarted the game and I will see you after I have enough materials for that last weapon. So, see you in a minute. So, I was going to go and farm the Royal Ludroff and then I realised I actually have to talk to Hinoa. With that, or is this Minito? We actually have to talk to Minito before I can take that quest on again. So we'll do this now and then I'll, there's going to be another cut. And then, then we'll go on to um, taking on the the quest that we need to take on, the urgent quest. Welcome to the hub. Skid, an urgent quest has come in for you. Your target this time is a Matsusuni um, in the Shrine Ruins. It may appear majestic and beautiful, but don't be fooled. Oof. These creatures are quite nimble and use their use the foam they create to manoeuvre an attack. Mm. 
They normally don't pose any threat to us, but this particular Matsumuni has become extremely agitated. I wonder why. <laughs> now then, good luck, uh, good luck to you out there. I have a special quest for you. Okay, so we will be back when I'm about to click that button. And we're back again. I entirely forgot the whole reason we were doing that is to get this weapon. My hammer's ready. So there's going to be another odd cut right in the middle of things. Okay, so that's not going to be any good against Matsumuni. I honestly don't remember. I can't know if further down there. Okay, Matsumuni. This one is Thunder. Um, thunder or Dragon? Or Lightning or Dragon? I forget whether it's Thunder or Lightning in this game. I have a special quest for you. Okay, uh, let's get what I've been riding back on. Virgin Quest. Which quest would you like? The Bewitching Dance. Yes! Good luck out there. Swap our loadouts. Let's make sure that's correct. Insectlave. We do have a Thunder one. Ah, oh, it only has a single decoration slot though. We also don't have a talisman that would um that boosts thunder attack. So let's take the one that gives us protective polish because it's better than nothing. We can still set the decorations, we can put one on. This is technically, or technically HR6, so we do need to give it due respect. Or it will put us on our ass. Shrine runes, aren't we? So it's going to be somewhere in the middle. Probably north. down, more or less. That was immediately half my health. <laughs> Just gone. Forget what the red bubbles do. I know what the green ones do. What the red ones do? Those ones we definitely don't want to get. You're the biopen, so your tail can't be severed. Body shot is required for this, you're going to get out of the. Oh. Oh. We still need body or legs, I assume. Just the head, let's just spam for a bit, see if we can hit something. Uh, 
can I have get? We want its legs. And I'm glad that missed because that technical or technically a dodge was out of time. Quick! And three shots on its claws. Take the three shots on its head then. Yeah. What do we play? It's head and it's back. This one's gonna hit hard. It's not aimed at us though, is it coming all the way around? Miss the green one. Get the green one. Go. The green ones heal, if I remember correctly. I don't know what the red ones do. The yellow one, or the white ones, obviously make you slight. And if you get too many of them, they make you fall over. You're my best pal. Need be, we need to run and dive. We are a long way away. Good. It's gonna turn around before. Oh, it's gonna leave. That's fine. That works. Yeah. Need stone. Smashing. We're gonna need tail and legs. Uh, you're not gonna be helpful in this situation. You just make it run. I don't think neither is that going to be any good. the attack coming but I wasn't quick enough to do anything about it. I'm gonna get out of there, I'm not fighting you in that tight quarters. I wanted your head this time round. Tail. There we go. <laughs> that works. Uh, good. We actually have one nearby. You listen to me now. Let's go kill two birds with one stone. You stay there. And smack into a wall. Turn around. And smack into a bird. This is going to be a um, troublesome fight. Yeah, You're mine to command. That's one. Close. 
Those were not the buttons I was pressing, game. I don't know which one of you did that, but well done. Let's see if we can't get some claws. I was stuck and out of wire bugs. Okay, it's tired. That's good. That gives me opportunity to... Whew. God damn it. My roll was out of time, but it's tired, so it couldn't get away with doing that itself. Shot at its tail. Are you leaving? You are. I got away. Go. That was not the button I was trying to press. Now I'm wasting time. Time for some sharpening. It's Ivy. Enemies not to be fresh. Twice in a row. What did we stun you? Okay, we need to get up and out. Oh, we just wasted the heal because Vin did the job for us. Body. I knew it needed his tail. Oh, no, away. You don't. I don't think it's capturable yet, but it must be getting there. Yeah, yeah it's heading down. So let's grab this, that, and jump. I pressed C, I disagree. Get off. Give me that. The 
wrong side. There's a cat type right on this side. I'm only assuming that its cause can be broken. Nice backflip. Damn it. This one's gonna hit hard. It's going all the way around. I tried to dive. But sprint takes a second to go off. But that was pretty much better. all of my health, wasn't it? Because we had just finished healing. I more or less knew that was probably going to be the case if I let that hit me. Probably should have been using these from the start. Do we not? Hmm. I thought I actually had them on there. Apparently not. Uh, we must not have been able to craft them yet. I was looking for max potions. But either we've not put them on us or we don't have access to them yet. Faster. Time for some sharpening. Just another defense. Oh, it's capturable. Okay. We don't need... We entirely wasted those two um, demon drugs then. Mega demon drugs. It's actually gone to sleep. Now. This is gonna be easy. Yes, it's going to be easy because it's asleep. Which means all we need to do is wiggle our way in between the middle of it. There we go. Try and bomb. Trank bomb, pitfall trap. I placed a trap. Hit from the trap. All done. There we go. I'm sure its claws must be breakable. We just probably didn't get enough damage on them, or maybe I should have bought the blunt insect and focused the claws down with that. We definitely got his head, his back, and his tail, though. <sighs> we need better armor now. Most definitely. Ooh, look at all the shiny things. We have a Matsumuni plate, Matsumuni water orb. Why does it have two rare drops? Bubble foam. If we can't craft a weapon with this many good things given to us. Hunter rank 6. We have made it. You have unlocked number new guild card. I actually forgot to check on the last one. Um, does it give the size information in here? I think it's up here. Well, I can't see it really. I'm fairly sure it says somewhere in the results screen um, whether or not you get a crown for the size. We have found our answers. The answers uh, that have plagued Kamara, Kam uh, the cause of the rampage. And you hunting that poor old Mitsu uh, led us to the answer. Uh, when the guild was investigating the, the monsters around it, they came around several tale or telltale signs. Mm and they were connected to the Rampage. The Rampage and that Azure Fiend. And that's not all. Our scouts inform us that they have spotted that Azure Beast um, above the Shrine Runes. 
Shortly after its appearance, every monster in the vicinity became ferocious or fervently violent. Uh, and that Matsumune, uh, being in mating season, was in uh, intensely affected. Yeah. We always thought that monsters attacking human settlements was simply nature at work. Um, as it turns out, it was really the work of that monster, uh, whipping up all the monsters into a frenzy, causing them to migrate. Uh, that's the secret behind the rampage. And that is why we were always sighting that beast shortly after the rampage started. The guild has named this fearsome mo monster Wind Serpent Ibushi. Uh, Ibushi? I think it's probably Ibushi. Um, the cause of the rampage must be slain. Uh, we are sure it won't be long before it returns once more. Uh, when that time comes, we're all counting on you. While we wait for further reports, please proceed with the newly available six star quests. Hey! Yo, Ace! Uh, we may crash partway through accepting these quests, in which case I will restart and come back. Just advance warning. Hanging in there? Whoa, Ace, you've really been thrashing on those monsters out there. Starting to look like a seasoned hunter now. Hmm. Uh, but even seasoned hunters need some spicy new switch skills. Uh, and I know you're ready to dig in, but I gotta warn you, these new skills I cooked up have quite some kick, like hiya! <laughs> Each one of them will put you flat on your butt if you're not ready, um, so you better lace up your uh, tabby. Learn the long sword. Dissect the dual blades. Grasp the gun lance. Invoke the insect glaive, finally! <laughs> Took us to HR6 to get the insect glaive. Be one with the bow. Keep it up. I think that covers all the weapons now. Uh, we're going to talk to your friend first. Because I imagine your friend has exactly the same thing to say. But let's talk to he, uh, sorry, Minato first. Hello. Hello, Skid. You are now able to accept six star quests. Please have a look at them when you have the time. Can you believe that the rampage is actually a large scale migration of monsters? That generally speaking tracks with the series. It's usually the monsters running away from another monster. <laughs> uh, I cannot fathom the degree of power the Wind Serpent Ibushi must wield uh, to give rise to such an uproar. Oh. In any case, it's not, there's not a moment to lose. We must quell the rampage and put an end to the pain that my sister is enduring. I've been waiting for you. Okay, let's just have a look at what we have in here. So we have seven of these again. That's more or less the same amount. That's a triple kill, double, double. Capture, double, double. I'm still noticing a distinct Don't lack of subspecies. Hey, there we go, the game crashed. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Let's go talk to everyone out here. Oh, it's you. Hey, Skid. Uh, how's hunting with the Palamute going? Yep. Um, the buddy, uh, the buddy Smithies uh, were telling me that they were uh, really want to uh, get better at making Palamute equipment, uh, but they need more practice. Uh, if you order some gear from them, not only will they give you some nice stuff, they'll also help you or help them out, uh, and me as well. Uh, once they've had enough practice, come talk to me and give, uh, and I'll give you some Palamute gear as a thanks. Forge 15 pieces of Palamute equipment. Should be simple enough. We need another seven. See you. What do we have the most of in terms of scrap? We have the most ore scraps, bone scraps, insect scraps. Oh, those are ore scrap pluses. Um, there's nothing that stops us from crafting the lower level stuff. Just don't equip it. One more. Do we have a bunch of 
higher level scraps that we can use. Humble scraps, Shudrun. Yeah, we need to start crafting um, tier 6 stuff. Um, is there an insect one? We have a bunch of insect scraps. You would assume that we could use them on something. Apparently not. At least not for the Palamut. And that's the one that they want us to craft things for. So let's just craft this set. Done. Hi. Thanks for your help, Skid. It's much appreciated. I'm sure they'll have the hang of making Palamut equipment now, which is not only benefit them, but everyone. Uh, and here's the Palamut gear, I promised. Uh, I know you'll go on to accomplish great things with it. Blitz scroll. The thing is, I kind of like the equipment that I got on the Palamut in terms of their actual gear rather than their um, armor and stuff. Uh, I can do, I just want to check and make sure there's not someone down here looking for help. Nope. I would have seen that marker by now. What would you like? I have come to the conclusion or come to a conclusion, specifically on how I should go about sharing my artistic gift with the world. Big thing or big things catch attention, do they not? Uh, that means if I were to write down my poetry with a big brush, it would too. Uh, it's a shame few of us will ever achieve such levels of genius as I. Anyway, I would like you to gather the materials for making such a brush. What's the bed and it's going to be a weapon? Meanwhile, I'll be composing a poem. Oh, there's our insect lathe. Uh, we already have everything. Here. Oh, hello. Ah, I see you bought my materials. Thank you, Hunter. Uh, I've been hard at work myself, but I may have hit a sort of writer's plateau. It is so heavy, the weight of my words inked down. No, this giant brush. Yeah, that actually might be my worst composition yet. Oh, by the way, I thought it might be helpful to share that you can also forge a giant brush at the smithy. Uh, go on and take a look at it, uh, if, you're, if you're interested. Goodbye. I do have a vent quest that I need to do at some point. But at this point, I'm so high level for them, we'll just blitz them. Um, specifically, I want to get the ones done that will get us layered armor and so the Sonic one, the Mega Man one, the Akami ones, um, all of those. I want to get them done at some point. But I'll probably do that in my own time at this point. I think I don't have the three episodes left. Welcome. Oh, skid skid, you'll never guess what happened. Mm -hmm. I went into the flooded forest to find some fish to make my bunny dango taste even better, but then... <laughs> A stupid Naga Cougar uh, came crashing through the forest making a huge racket and chased away all the fishies. Mm -hmm. uh, so I went to a different spot to fish, but then a, a Chuwari, a Juradura, um, wait, I got it, a nigh on unpronounceable name that I cannot remember, uh, a big stupid giant fishy showed up and started flinging mud everywhere. <laughs> the fishy were gone, I got covered in mud and I didn't catch anything. It was literally the worst. Um, could you please do something about these dummies for me? Please? Uh, and maybe throw a punch or a kick in for me too. <laughs> yes. oh, hi. Mm, hey, listen, there's this, um, this thing I can only, or I feel like I can only truly talk to you about. <laughs> I want to make some dango that are really healthy so that everyone can stay in tip-top shape. Mm -hmm. uh, I've been reading some books um, with uh, Otima uh, about a farm, a sutra like um what stuff is good for you and all that stuff uh -huh. um but hands-on experience is better right and for that i need some stuff that might be a teensy bit hazardous mm. uh, and no one does hazardous like you skid maybe or could you maybe possibly get me some uh okay yeah we've not encountered a soma camp since um low rank so we'll get that or that'll be done 
in due course. Bye bye. Hey Skid, you know I'm super grateful that you always stop by and order Bunny Dango, right? <laughs> um, by the way, do you know what a quality wyvern egg is? Oh god no. <laughs> I know what it is. I know very much what it is. It's the kind of egg that if you pick up, a Rathian will chase you about the map. Ceaselessly. <laughs> So there's this super expensive, hard to get ingredient, but people say they're the yummiest or bestest eggs ever. Imagine if I made Dunny or Bunny Dango with them. They'll be the yummiest too. Yep, yep. Uh, but it'll take so much time and effort to go get one myself, not to mention the whole danger thing. Uh, but you don't mind a little danger, do you, Skid? You'll get one for me, won't you? I will, but only because I'm completing all the quests like the idiot that I am. Fine, I will get you your damn wyvern egg. I will run across the map. With a Rathian on my tail, if it will make you happy, and put a nice little tick mark next to the quest. <laughs> uh, very safe dango added. Oh, Skid, hey, hey, listen. Uh, guess what? We reworked the recipes and all of my usual dango are now yummy than ever, blah, blah, blah. Uh, the whole tea shop was busting, with, uh, uh, busting their butts to make them super yummy. Uh, so she would totally order, uh, order some ASAP. Okay. She has been spoken to. She had a lot to speak about. Hey. Ah, Skid. Uh, rare to see you without a um, petal ice on your arm these days, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, since they seem to be providing you helpful, how about a little upgrade? <laughs> uh, this will be the last time, though. you got to make yours or make yourself a top-notch hunter. Uh, you don't need old Fugan trying to help you out. Um, it looks like you haven't collected every kind of petal ice out there just yet. But hey, uh, you do, uh, you can do so whenever it takes takes your fancy. Well, the fancy takes you. All right, off you go then, Squirt. Uh, go on, or go to greater hunts, greater heights, and greater honors. Now get to it. Hey, they've been upgraded. I mean, I'm not even sure where we get more petal ice. Well, I assume the one that I've already been using is just now, yeah, a better version. Demon is the one we're using. Fortitude, Strength, and then Hunter. Yeah, those are the, the four we've all, 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 always had. Or at least we've had three of them, I think. I don't know if we've had all four of them. Oh, it's you. Um, it took some help from Nagako and the others, but we can now forge more kinds of decorations for you. Uh, you'll be faced with some grueling hunts from here on. Make sure, uh, I'm sure, make sure your gear doesn't leave you lacking. Bye. How are you doing? I'm doing good, I believe. Are you forging or upgrading? I'd be forging. You should have a weapon for me. Oh god, look at them all. <laughs> There's so many more now, this is going to take so much longer. Okay, we was told there was a bush. Some hunters literally take hours. I'm used to waiting. I really should be looking down this side and um, painting down this side because that's probably where I'm going to notice it. Ah, there you are. Ah, damn it. I, kn I knew I hadn't broken the claws. The claws are the things we're missing. So that has a higher base attack and a affinity on it. But otherwise it's honestly not that great. Um if it's not in here. Oh right, yeah, I forgot entirely about that section of things. No, it should be in here somewhere. 
My hammer's ready. One would assume. Gotta be, um, or it's gotta be its own tree. I can't imagine it not being just sitting on its own. Smithy tree, but that's Case just. Makes waste. Oh, there it is. <laughs> the there it is. Um, that is a high base attack, but it is at the cost of affinity. And it is upgradable. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. What are you next? Do you have something else for me? You don't. Do the buddies have anything for me? New maps they can go out on? It's good. I have quite an important message for you. Uh, we have modified the Meowcenaries kite so that they are now able to survey further off territories. This means they can come across new and different materials to collect. If you have no qualms with it, I'd like to get started right away. Okay, is that everyone? Nope. Couple in the grabbing hubs. Decorations. Until next time. Food is better. Okay. Hey! Have a seat! So That'll be that. We'll call it there. I'll work out between now and next episode. Hey, come on. Line up beside me. There we go. Close enough. I'll work out between now and next episode whether or not we're going to do double episodes a week or whether I will just cut down the number of the quests we're going to do. Um, for example, of the extra quests, maybe we will only actually show the weapon one that is for the insect glaive and we'll ignore the other ones, or at least I'll do them off the camera. That sort of thing. But I'll work that out between now and then. But anyway, for now, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the show. We'll be back next week and hopefully... I'll see you next time. Cheerio.